Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Waalaikumsalam warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Good morning everybody. Good morning. How are you today? I'm fine. Thanks. Uh, now what time today? Okay, let's see the attendance, please. I will call your name and press your hand. Uh, Hamam. Yes, sir. Nuris. Yes, sir. Present. Ika. Adira. Uh, Alvan. Yeah. Okay. And Tias. Yes. Okay. Rahim. Yes. Where is Rahim? Six, 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 Okay guys, now we are going to learn a new vocabulary. Yay! Yay. 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 Uh, now, you have to listen to me and look at me. The first one, morning. Morning, what is morning? Morning is uh, when the sun rises. Oh. Now! This yes. is morning. Now we are studying in the morning. Next, wake up. So after sleep, I wake up. Oh. Oh. Yeah. And next, brush. Brush. Brush your teeth. Brush your clothes. Brush. Brush. And the next is teeth. Your teeth. Yeah, your teeth. teeth. Touch your teeth. Your teeth. Yes. Where is your teeth? teeth. Yeah. <laughs> that is your teeth. Next, wash. 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 With the water you wash your face. Wash your plate after you eating. Ooh. Yeah. Wash. <laughs> to clean. And next, face. Your face. Touch your face. Yeah, you oh, all wow. have a face. Beautiful face. And next, breakfast. You eat before go to school. In the morning, you have breakfast. Oh. Breakfast. Eating in the morning. Yeah, breakfast. Right? Breakfast. Yeah. breakfast. And go. Go. Go is you go to school. Yes. Go to hospital, go to yes. the market. Go. Go. Go oh. to some place. Okay? Yes. Some places. Next is the last. School. School. School is the place you are studying. So now you are in school. Yes. Got it all? Yes. Now yes. repeat after me. Morning. 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 Wake up. Wake up. Brush. Brush. Teeth. Teeth. And wash. 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 Face. Face. And breakfast. Breakfast. Go. Go. And school. 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 Okay guys, I will give you some notebooks and you have to write all the vocabulary on this notebook, okay? Okay! okay. okay. I will repeat the vocabulary the first one is morning. 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 M O R N I N G. Morning. Morning. Yes. Great. Morning. Next, wake up. Wake up. Wake up. W A K E U P. Wake up. 
Done. And next, press. P L U S A. Thank you, sir. Yes, great. Yay. Press. Next, teeth. T double E double E T H T double E T H done? Yes sir. Next wash W A S H W W A S H wash wash like this sir oh, great <laughs> and next face face F A C E F A C E face face oh, yes. Yes. next I brush my teeth. I brush my teeth. 
did. I wash my face. I wash my face. I have a breakfast. I have a breakfast. Then I go to school. Then I go to school. Yeah, thank you. Give a boss. And now I want you, Ika, to sit in front and practice all the vocabulary. Yes, sir. Give a boss, guys.
Yeah, from second group. We would like to explain you about the Sagistopedia method. The first is the historical background from Sagistopedia. Sagistopedia is a teaching method developed by Bulgarian scholar, a professor George Lozano, a physician, psychiatrist, and brand physiologist. So, the term was coined and published in Bulgaria for the first time in 1965, so in English in 1967. Sagestopedia was founded in 70 by Professor Lozano, so, and it was acknowledged in 70, in the late 70 by an international group of UNESCO experts. And the purpose of Sagestopedia is Sagestopedia is generally superior teaching method for any subject and for any type of student compared with traditional methods. Standards should be set up for training and certification and maintaining and standard of Sagestopedic training. Sagestopedic training of teacher of various competencies and so be started as soon as possible. Sagistopedia also has three main aspects in this method. The first is approach. As we know that approach has two kinds of aspects. That is the theory of language and the theory of learning. The theory of language from this method is Actually, Lozano itself does not articulate the, this method in teaching is no theory a language. It means that Lozano uh, didn't uh, doesn't assume that this Sagistopedia method has a theory of language. But in my conclusion, that this Sagistopedia use the interactional views. Because the Sagistopedia itself used the language as the material, as the vehicle, and the relationship between the teacher and the students. And then the theory of learning. The theory of learning itself actually has such as behaviorism, constructivist, cognitive, and others. But the Sagistopedia method has uh, six principle according to the Ben Croft. It is the first is authority, authority, and the second is infantilization, and the third is double planetness, and the fourth is intonation. So rhythm and answer pseudo passiveness. Authority means giving the authority to the learner highly. Because when we give, when the teacher gives the authority to them, so it makes them become more learner, more learning than before. And the authority from the teacher is when the teacher has a acting ability and self-confidence and personal distance and positive attitude. And then infantilization. In decision means the teacher and the learner are same as a parent and child. So the relationship between a parent and child is referred to the teacher and child. And then double planetness means that the learner have to learn from everything, from everything that they know in that place. So intonation and rhythm usually use when it is a, a session a session in the music in the music in the, when the listening music they use uh, intonation and rhythm to make a good condition and situation and the last is concern pseudo passiveness it means that when it when it's teaching so the the situation of that time is more silent because when the silent time the learner have to have to listen the teacher 
And the second aspect of suggestive idea method is the design. As we know, the design has objective, syllables, activities, teacher roles, learner roles, and instructional roles. So, the objective of suggestive idea is understanding or creative solution of the problem. It means that the learner have to solve their problem with the with creative way. And then syllables. Syllables suggest the idea is going to task a month, 30 days. 30 days with the tens units of study. This means so in the in one unit use three days. So every day use four hours and they use six only six days in a week so the syllables from the one unit into three days it's it consists of a half day and after that the second day is full day and the last day is the half day again the half the first half day is going to be presented and discussion about the materials and the next day is going to be a practice in the in that place in that area and the last is half day is going to be evaluating of the previous days and then is activities the activities of this this method is imitation role play and question and answer Imitations as like the, the learner imitate what the teacher do as like a role play also about the role play about the pronunciation and etc. Question and answer when the learner doesn't know the meaning of the phrase so they have to 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 ask to the teacher and then Listening a music, of course, because the because the suggestopedia method uh, always use the music in the teaching, and then the teacher roles. The roles of the teacher in this method is active, active because when the teacher have to act like what they what they say, such as brush the feet, so they use. A hand to show that they brushing a thing and etc. And after that, uh, creative. Creative means that the teacher before entering the class must prepare the class, must set out the class, become a good condition situation to make a suggestion that the teacher must organize them the, the learner to make a peaceful condition the learner rules the learner rules is also active and commitment and the volunteer this means that the actually the suggestopedia learner is volunteer from the aspect before from the courses and another institution so in active meaning that the learner have to act like a teacher what the teacher practice they have also to practice it and then the instructional roles is going div uh, is divided into two two aspects the first is direct and the second is indirect the direct aspect is using text and tape and the indirect aspect using classroom pictures and music. It means in the direct the, the learner have been prepared by the text from the from the teacher and the, by the, the by the music from the tape. And another indirect in, in indirect materials, maybe the classroom pictures is going to be uh, prepared by the teacher before the class. And the third aspect of the suggestopedia method is procedure. The procedure is going 
to be divided into three. The first is oral review from the previous lesson. The second is the materials is presented and dis and discussed. And the last is a concert session. The first is oral review from the previous lessons. The teachers have to review the lesson and remembering the learner about the previous lesson. Maybe about 5 until 10 minutes or another, another time. Or maybe more or less. So the second is a material is presented and discussed. It means that we give, the teacher give a new material to the students. So, the last is a concert session. It is also called as the heart of the Sagesta method. Because the concert session, it means that the teacher giving a suggestion to the student by the, by the creative solution such as playing a music and also the solemn silent and etc. So in the concert session there are two sessions. The first session is the beginning. Make the learner to stop their conversation and listening the music. After that the teacher give a several passage and message to make a mood. Maybe giving the suggestion to the learner and and then the, the learner become more peaceful in their heart and their mind. The teacher asked to the learner to read to recite and to read the text of the book. The teachers turn off the music and explaining the lesson and the learner must be silent to, to listen a teacher's reading and explanation. So and the second session the music plays again so the, the learner is going to touch by the teacher instruction by the teacher practice and the teachers ask them to close the book and after that they are uh, using a role play maybe they practice what the teachers do and the last of the session the, the learner must leave the room silently. Okay, maybe that's all from the three main aspects, the approach, design, and procedure of the suggestive idea. And the next is... And the last criticism. The reason for decline. Reason for decline. The first time is there is little evidence to support the claim of success. The second is Many people find classical music irritating and the last is the length of dialogue is too long. Uh, however, Sagestopedia has has an advantage. The first uh, the advantage is the youth music creates a comfortable environment and the second is make learners stimulate learning via the power of positive suggestion and the solution is maybe we can use the another method such as total physical response and communicative language teaching or maybe uh, audio lingualism okay guys uh, that's all from us our presentation today and the last assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh